A new school year has begun for many Korean students this week. More than 70% of high school graduates in Korea enter college, but not all of them attend what you call traditional universities. A growing number of them are going online to do their studies. Gwon Soa reports. Excitement is in the air at Seoul National University's orientation ceremony where thousands of new young people are marking the start of student life. It's the same scene at another welcoming event for freshmen at another university. But here at Seoul Cyber University, students do not walk around the campus looking for their classrooms, they jump on the internet to take their classes. Moon so Yun is a Cyber University sophomore. She graduated from a two-year college program but became interested in counseling psychology and tried to find a way to balance a job and her studies. The biggest advantage of taking cyber university classes is that you have no restrictions as to time, location or age. So Yun says sudden pop quizzes and discussions make the courses more interactive. Many cyber universities do not limit their education to online classes but give students the opportunity to take part in offline courses and activities at their offline campuses. Professors say online classes are not only good for students but for teachers as well. For professors of offline universities, it's not easy to receive feedback or monitor yourself. And that goes for me too, as I've worked at conventional universities for 10 years. But since my classes are now filmed, I can get concrete feedbacks. There were only nine cyber universities in Korea in 2001. Today, there are 21. The number of cyber students is on the rise too, jumping from 6,000 in 2001 to nearly 115,000 in 2013. Experts attribute the jump to the increasing number of students pursuing lifelong education. Much lower tuition prices have also played a role. However, cyber universities still face challenges compared to brick-and-mortar institutions. Some areas, is, uh, their quality is doubt. Is uh, in terms of the uh, uh, degree programs and the methodology of uh, teaching and the learning and uh, their uh, job skills, etc. Despite the self-evident figures and the increasing popularity of cyber universities, it will take time for them to develop the respect afforded to conventional schools. Kwon Soa, Arirang News.